and it's day 14 of our 14 day challenge. Your story, your life, where you discover that the story that you tell becomes the life that you live. Well, last night I hope you were on fire, on fire as you poured your story out onto the pages. I hope that you felt such a sense of being, feeling like you're flying and soaring, because you deserve that. I mean, congratulations to you. You've shown up from the very beginning. You've brought your courage and your curiosity and your humor here. And for that, wow, the rewards that you're feeling now and the rewards that you'll continue to feel a month from now, a year from now. I hope when you look in the mirror today, when you're you know, playing with your hair or brushing your teeth, I hope that you see reflected back in your eyes such a love and self-respect because it's time to say, wow, I did good work here. Oh, when I think about the beginning of this journey 14 days ago, you answered a call. You answered the call of a community, of a, of a kind of revolution of artists who are seeking to connect with the world in deeper, more meaningful ways. People who, who are entrepreneurs and creators who want to own they want the end-to-end -end ownership of what they're doing. You're part of a unique and exclusive group of people who want to express in full and satisfying ways. That's who you are. And now you have this, the power of storytelling. In this time, we had a promise. A promise right up front at the beginning of this challenge. I said, if you showed up and you committed, we would get three major things done here. We were going to create, we were going to connect, and we were going to contribute in a way that would give you tools to live your night life more fully. And we have. What did we do? Creating. Well, first what we did was we created a new broader understanding for you of story. We went all the way back to the caveman so you could see the value of story in the caveman and the evolutionary process. We looked at science and discovered the brain has hardwired us for storytelling. We looked into our world and saw that story is a tool, a force of nature in science and business and entertainment and every place where human beings are communicating. We created a new understanding within you about story and we looked at your stories so that you would have a brand new way of playing with story. In developing your knowledge base, we of course increased your competence because competence and confidence always are linked together. The second promise was that we were going to connect by, by looking at these historical aspects of story. You now had new connections. Oh, I didn't realize that was going on. I didn't realize the stories I was telling would reverberate as long as Michelangelo's story has through generations of my family. We made new connections within you on all different levels, intellectually, emotionally and so on. You began to connect with the world because you began to test your stories out on people. You began to see and gather, gather results back. And finally, now we've begun to contribute. You're shining in a whole new way. Is there a better way that a person can contribute than to, to hold themselves in utter self-joy? and then radiate that, shower that unto the world, and you will continue to contribute, I suspect, for a very long time. 
If I was going to give you three things to take away from this program, I would suggest that number one, you continue to tell your story, working on it privately. Number two, that you continue to share your story and begin to gently influence in the world that you live in. And number three, come join us for our next events. Come and interact and meet the people in this community that you're part of. Look at our website, www.susanjoygreco.com. See what events are coming our webinars, seminars, live events. Come hang out with the people who are interested, who are adventurous, who are boldly going to the places that you want to go. We're going to end where we began by going back to day one. Your last homework assignment for this challenge is to consider your major subjects, your body, your mind, your money, your work, your home, your relationships, and rank them on a scale of one to ten. Ten being, of course, super. And then take that when you're done and compare it to day one and notice the improvements. I think you'll be delighted. There's so much I want to say right now, but honestly, I think that just holding this moment and giving you my biggest smile is the best thing I can do because for me, this is what I live for, to give back in this way and to shower the world, to use technology to do this. Gosh, I must be the luckiest person in the world. So thank you. Thank you for, for joining me in this. Thank you for joining this community. Thank you most of all. for reaching into yourself and bringing out the best, the best that you are. Please continue to do that with the courage and the curiosity and the humor that you've brought here. I'm looking forward to seeing you or hearing you live on a webinar or live event soon. Be well, friends. <laughs>